Today we're going to be talking about Emmet I.O. It supports a number of different IDEs or code editors. Check for your one in here and you'll see how to install it. Uh, today we're going to be using brackets. This is my favorite editor and this is what I always use. Uh, I'll show you how to install a plugin with this and we'll be we'll get up and running. I don't want to talk too much. Alright, you see I got brackets editor opened here. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to throw this in here. Um, just open up a new or create a folder for all your projects. All right, we'll create a new file file by just you know by right clicking and then hit new file. All right, so we'll just say index.html. Okay, wonderful. Just under file extension managers and type Emmet, and we get it here. We get Emmet. This is the one you need. And just click install close now what you want to do is restart create uh, you know basically they'll have a, a template for you so it's real simple so all you got to put in is H let me put that in all right files open HTML 5 or HTML colon 5 then press the tab key it creates all this for you here now let's say we want to create a div with a class of header so We'll say we'll say div, and if you put a dot, that means class. You can say header, and it'll create a div with the class of header. H1, this one means one level down, so it'll be a child element with the with the bracket there. So let's say we'll say H1, and we'll call it. And when you put this, when you put this bracket here, this means you know the type what goes in between the element. So we're gonna say Lamar's page, uh, uh, typo, page, tab. Okay, see now, see how this is, you know, see how this is uh, creating a, a, making our workflow a lot quicker. You can also do things like this. Let's say we want an unordered list. So UL, and then we're gonna make the child element an LI, and then we're going to go times five. So we're going to make five list elements. Just hit the tab key. Bam. You got every, you got five list elements. This, this makes your development so quick. It's not even funny. All right. What else are you going to go to? All right. A div with an ID. So just hit the hashtag. And then you put, uh, let's just call this nav. All right. So it's going to be a div with the ID of nav. So wonderful. Moving along. All right. Now let's say you want to come up one. All right. Let's say we have a div where we want to make a link. And for whatever reason, or we want to make the link on the same level as the paragraph tag. All you got to do is add a plus there, and it'll put them two on the same level. Uh, like, a, a, I guess, a sister element, not a child element of, of the link when you do it that way. All right. Table. You say T head. Then we're going to make T body. Let's say th t body and then we're gonna make a like tr and then td times three okay all that code just one one simple line and we created all that code right there just basically wanted to give you an overview to get your feet wet uh, if you want to get some more information go to Emmet IO here uh, I recommend this checking in the documentations tab and going all the way down to the bottom here where it says cheat sheet I mean, I gave you the basics on it so once you look at this you'll pretty much have an understanding of how to do just about everything and I mean, it's pretty long and it's pretty in depth. This is something you definitely want to learn. This will cut your workflow and your time in half. 
Um, as always, thank you for your time and attention. And uh, subscribe to my channel. And you'll learn something. Goodbye.